All right, welcome back. Big share today. Teens fleeing Facebook and by significant numbers. Study done by a marketing firm. Back in the spring, 72% of teens said they were on Facebook. But by the fall, months later, that dropped to 45%. Where are they going? Instagram and Twitter. 76% they want Instagram, snapping the photos. Nearly 60% of teens active on Twitter. They're tweeting. All right, so let's bring in a couple of teenagers. Joining us now, Taylor. She's on the right. Samantha here on the left. Samantha, I'll start with you. Are, have you, are you done with Facebook? Um, no, I actually still use Facebook, but I do prefer Instagram. Um, I think Facebook is a lot more clutter and Instagram's more sweet and to the point. So you still use it a little bit, but not like the other two? Yes. Got it. Taylor, what about you? Facebook, thumbs up or down? completely down Ooh. i hate it i think it's just completely <laughs> spammed with a whole bunch of videos and a whole bunch of pictures that you could just go on twitter and instagram and vine to look at i feel like facebook is just the website to promote other social medias so there's no point in really having facebook at all wow so you're not pulling any punches there you know i even i've got a <laughs> couple of teenage sons i asked them you guys on facebook anymore no and no, one of my sons said, it's outdated. Taylor, I'll stay with you. You agree with that? Outdated? And um, Completely. I feel like Instagram and Twitter are more of the bigger things right now. Um, because Facebook, it was supposed to be for, like, to get, keep in touch and just get to talk to all your friends. But now you can more do that on Instagram and see pictures of them and be like, oh, wow, they look amazing. And just Facebook, I feel like no one even really goes on it anymore. Hmm. Like, it's just old news. Yeah, there you go. Uh, Samantha, what about that? And is the parent factor something that plays in that you know, hey, if I go on here, there's going to be a ton of adults and I might cross paths with mom or dad? Um, yes, for sure. My family members are always spamming my Facebook every time I like <laughs> post something. They're always commenting on it and liking it. And I always have like 5,000 notifications from the same person. So that gets annoying. Not good. What about you, Taylor? <laughs> The parent um, factor, yeah. the adult factor, not good on Facebook? <laughs> um, yeah, my mom is always on it, and she's always <laughs> spamming my thing as well. Um, but I also hate the fact my family members send me those game notifications all the time, and I cannot <laughs> stand it. <laughs> all right, you, you agree, huh, Samantha? Yes. Yes, for sure. Uh, enough with that stuff there. Okay, so and then you guys say Instagram, Twitter, What's the next thing? What's on the horizon we don't know about now that you guys think everyone's going to be heading to, that you guys are just toying with right now? And Samantha, I'll start with you. I have no clue, honestly. Everyone I know still uses face or Instagram and Twitter, Twitter like all the time, and that's about it. Nobody really gets on Facebook anymore except for like pictures and all right. things like. That. Taylor, Snap, Snapchat's big, right? Yeah, I actually have a Snapchat, and I use it all the time. I use Snapchat and Instagram. I'm now upcoming on Twitter. I just started one, and I love it. But I feel like the upcoming one is going to be those, like, um, there's Tinder that everyone's using. And even my friends that are, like, young are using stuff like that. And it's just now upcoming, and people are now getting onto it. So there you go. You heard it firsthand from Samantha and Taylor, teenagers that pretty much say Thumbs down for the most part on Facebook. Uh, Facebook. Really interesting stuff. Guys, thanks again. Samantha Taylor, appreciate your time. Yasmin, over to you. Thank you. Oh, oh sorry. I was accepting a friend request from my mom on Facebook. Yeah. <laughs>